Well, I swore I wasn't going to buy any new silver while the prices were so high, and I've been pretty good about that. It's been... I bought one numismatic uh, specimen in ATB, I think, in the last two years, and I just don't really uh, want to buy at these prices in general, but there are exceptions, and today I got one of them here, so let me tear into it and show you what it is and why the deed was done. I didn't get a deal on this new. No. I paid probably about the amount of uh, you would pay for an American Silver Eagle per ounce. Maybe, actually I think they're a little bit less than the ASC price. Well, at the time. I'm just gonna cut it down here. No point in point in uh, wasting everyone's time, especially mine, because I got, I want to get to doing nothing, because I just got off work, and, wow, I would put that in there pretty darn good, yeah, I think the paperwork's over there, I'll get it after I'm done making this video, so, let's see, what did I get, I will cut further, For anyone that's newer that's watching this, I've been part of the uh, you know, kind of a minor uh, player in this whole stack of things since 2013. If you ever wanted ideas, you can certainly go back and look at my backlog of videos. Unless Google finds a reason to ban them. Or they just basically ban anything I hear these days even as not controversial as stacking gold and silver. So I picked up three. What did I get? I will show you what I got. It is the Tuskegee Airmen ATV. I picked up one, two, three of these bad boys. Okay. You know what I'm going to do? I'm just going to shift you there for a second. I'm going to get a better backdrop here because it's awful glary. Maybe this will improve things. My used up dish rag, maybe. But yeah, and if anyone's not familiar. Well, I just boomered it. I pushed the button on the bottom of the phone while in landscape mode again. Last time I did that, I just said, screw it, I'm not gonna make any more of this video. I'm just gonna put it out it is, as is, but I'll tell you what. I'll go ahead on the Movie Maker, I'll splice the two pieces together. I can't believe I do that, this freaking boomer tech crap, but yeah. So here's, here's the thoughts on the Tuskegee Airmen ATB. If anyone remembers a few years ago with the Frederick Douglass ATB, that one brings in some pretty good money on the secondary market. And you might say, well, what's this guy do with Frederick Douglass? I think this is the only other coin that profiles a black gentleman on the coin. Will it be another winner? Will it? I don't know. Maybe. But hey, I'm a... Uh, I'm a capitalist type. Got to try to, you know, look ahead and try to make, you know, think about how to make some money down the road. If silver goes down and these go down just because of the spot, hey, so I'll just sit on it. No big deal. I bought so much silver over the years, averaging below below eighteen dollars an ounce. So <laughs> this is hardly a dent in all the stacking I've done over the years. But no, nah, this isn't a normal activity. It's a, it's a one-off. So I hope this, uh, you know, maybe uh, somebody else thinks this is a, maybe an interesting uh, way to possibly, you know, you know, make some money down the road. Otherwise, I mean, it is a nice coin, you know, just overall. So I'll just say have a great afternoon and. Uh, 
See you whenever I get the next uh, delivery. Bye-bye.